I'm going to show you a range of braille displays that work with both the iPhone and the iPad really, really well. Of course, these braille displays will also work with your computer, either a Mac or a PC, and they'll also work with Windows tablets and Android tablets. But today, the focus is just on the iPhone and the iPad. I've got about five to show you. So first of all, I'm going to show you um, one called a Focus. This is called a Focus 40. The reason why it's called a Focus 40 is because there are 40 braille cells. That means it can read 40 characters at a time across the screen. The other Focus is called a Focus 14 and that has 14 braille cells and it can read 14 characters at a time. The only difference between these two devices is cost. So how much do they cost? The Focus 40 is under $3,000. It's actually come down considerably. It's $2,800. And it's a fantastic device to have at home on your Mac or your PC because you can read lots and lots of text really quickly because of the 40 cells. However, if you're looking for some portability, the Focus 14 is probably the best one for an iPhone or an iPad. The Focus 14 costs $1,300. Both of these braille displays are made in America by a company called Freedom Scientific and you can buy them here in Australia through a supplier called Quantum or Quantec. Okay, so what are all these buttons on these devices? The first row of 40 cells is a refreshable braille display and that will tell you what's on the screen. That's constantly moving and we'll see that in a moment and that's how you read text. So rather than use your eyes on the screen, you're using the tip of your finger on this refreshable braille. These buttons here are WYSIWYG buttons and they enable you to move around the screen as well as the front panel thumb keys. These buttons here are a keyboard and that's called a braille keyboard and you can type text onto your email or onto, uh, onto notes in your iPhone or on your iPad using this Braille keyboard. And they're really easy keys to press. It's, it's a really great little functional keyboard. Even the smaller one, the keyboard's quite big enough for you to type comfortably. Okay, that's the focus range. The next range that I'm going to recommend are made in Germany and by a company called Baum, B-A-U-M. And they come in three different sizes. We have the little 12 cell, this tiny little thing, and that's called a Connie. The second one is 24 cells and that's um, called a Braille Connect 24. And the third one is 32 cells and that's called a Braille Connect 32. The prices are the Focus, the, sorry, the um, Connie is actually $3,000. The Braille Connect 24 is $3,500 and the Braille Connect 32 is $5,000. So they are considerably more expensive but they have a lot of functionality that's very, very clever. If you're using these Braille devices all the time, they're certainly worth considering. Now the features are a Braille keyboard. Um, this is the Braille display here. They have an extra row of Braille keys on the side, which enable you to do chord commands really easily. And they have a little joystick. So they're, they're, they're quite nifty at navigating around the screen. The Braille Connie, however, this 12 cell one, has, the, has a fairly um, difficult keyboard. The keys are quite small. Some people can use them, others find it a little bit too, too difficult. So they're the booms. And I have one more. And this is called an ESIS, and this is actually from France. And this has got a braille keyboard, and it's got 12 cells. It also has a little memory card on the side and it has its own applications inside it. 
so you can actually disconnect it from your iPhone and just use it as a little braille display and a note taker on its own so it's quite clever. I bought all of these three, four from a company in Sydney called Optec Systems but I know that the, the BOM has also rebranded as a humanware product.